think of a game where you fought back so many times and then end up uh, on a bit of an awkward uh, misplay uh, ends up being the winning goal for them? Well, we're not going to win many games giving up six, five. Um, it, misplay or not at the end of the night, that's too many. They're too talented a team for us to play as loose and poorly as we did in our zone. And uh, that's team wide. Um, I thought some of our grinders did their thing tonight. Wasn't uh, overly impressed with a lot of our skill players. I didn't think they, uh, they produced or performed to the level that we needed them to. And, um, you know, yet we score four and some of those guys are involved in, the, in, the, in that, which we need. But it's all the other uh, areas of the game that have to get better. You mentioned those grinders and you mentioned them this morning as well, needing to step up. Were you pleased with the performance of one in particular, Iro Pekarinen, who uh, Matt Hendricks really liked his game tonight? Absolutely. Um, you know, it doesn't take a real avid fan to see that he had a real high passion level and a commitment level to, uh, to the team and, and uh, played extremely hard. He was physical, he was hard, he scored a goal, he was real good on the penalty kill, block shots. Um, you know, if I'm, uh, if I'm sitting on the bench, he's probably guilting me into playing uh, a harder game than, than maybe what I've, I've been giving. So uh, we're happy with him, of course. Did you think the fourth goal uh, might have been called back, or did you get an explanation on that? Uh, I thought it was going to be called back based on uh, you know, the, the, the stick, but I don't have all the replays on the bench or anything like that. And um, I'll have to go back and look at it now. Toronto gets to make the call. and. Um, you know, when they do, there's nothing anybody can do about it. You just drop the puck and you play again. Cassian scores his first of the season, first as an Oiler. What is he giving you out there on the ice? Uh, Zach's a pretty honest player. That's the one thing that I've figured out in his three or four games with us. Um, he wants to do things well. He wants to, uh, to do things right. Uh, he's got a physical, um, you know, his power game, his ability to power his way through and play physical is, is important. Uh, nice to see him get rewarded with a goal tonight. And, um, you know, as, the, as time goes on here, uh, I can see myself and the coaching staff trusting him more and more. Does he look like he's getting winded in his shifts or he's, he's through that sack? Uh, gas. He's had a whirlwind tour since he's been called up. Um, our whole team has been through a lot of hockey and a lot of travel over the last week. Um, yet I think he held his own for the most part. He managed his game well. So. Would I say he was an effective player for our team tonight? Absolutely. Is your goaltender, you just can't get over the hump? Yeah. Well, I'm not sure the team, you know, we can push him over the hump or we can pull him back down the hump, and I think we pulled him back down tonight. So um, you know, there's probably one or two that he'd like to, uh, to have another kick at. Uh, but he also made some really good saves, and, and uh, the goals didn't go up on the board. So, um, you know, it's... We need to we need to help him just like he needs to help us. Todd, you thought he said no, he needs a really good game to get his, mentally to get his own game back. You know, like a game where he had like November where he's playing. Yeah, well, then let's get it. Let's get it from him and let's go. Todd, you've often talked about teaching, and tonight there was sort of a sequence of you being vocal with Taylor, and and he moved to the end of the bench. Then you're kind of patting him on the back and maybe building him up. And then he goes out and sets up uh, Leon Drysaddle. Is that just a kind of chronological events that sometimes happen with young players that you're molding the way you are? Yeah, there's, um, you know, the team comes first. It's never going to change here. And uh, there's moments in the game where you teach, um, you know, you teach hockey skills and you teach tactics and then you teach leadership too. And um, we had some of those moments tonight. We had good learning moments for a team. Um, and individually, and um, uh, you know, some responded well, some didn't. Uh, it's not just about Taylor; it's about the whole group. And um, as we continue to grow, we're going to have tough nights like this. Uh, but we better get, you know, we better move the needle forward. We we can't take steps back. And uh, frustration is a uh, is a quality or a characteristic that does doesn't do anybody any good. It sucks the life out of uh, individuals and out of the team. And um, when we're tired and played as much as we have, we've got to find a way to transfer frustration into uh, being productive on the ice.